Hello, Gettysburg. My name is uh, Kevin Hardy. I'm a uh, career technical education teacher here at Gettysburg Area High School. I've worked here for the high school since uh, 2004. Um, prior to coming to Gettysburg, I taught technology education for eight years at uh, Walter Johnson High School in Bethesda, Maryland, part of the Montgomery County Public School uh, system there. And a year prior to that, uh, I was a middle school teacher at Farmwell Station Middle School in Ashburn, Virginia. From a large family, I'm one of eight children. I grew up in Falls Church, Virginia. I now live in Orangeville with my wife and four children. I have a son and two daughters in college. My youngest son is a freshman at Bigwaville High School. Many of you may also know me as a swim coach and aquatics instructor at the YWCA, where I coach the shark swim team, as well as work with the high school team. Um, I studied mechanical engineering and industrial uh, engineering education at Virginia Tech, uh, where I participated in a, a year of varsity swimming, four years of Army ROTC, uh, the regimental band, and uh, the University Rescue Squad. I graduated from VPI in 1994 with a, a teaching degree in industrial and engineering education. And while teaching is my principal occupation, which you uh, may not know about uh, me, is that I'm a um, pro board certified firefighter and an emergency medical technician uh, with almost 30 years of service in public safety. I've spent uh, the past 33 summers as an open water lifeguard and aquatic safety instructor at Lake Barcroft, Virginia. And I've served my communities uh, in both Virginia and in Pennsylvania as a uh, volunteer firefighter and emergency medical technician, uh, even working for a period of time as an EMT. Um, I bring these experiences as well as experience as a uh, part-time um, chimney sweep uh, and electric boat technician um, to the vocational classroom. Um, I'm passionate about helping uh, kids find a career pathway that fits their interests uh, and sharing my own experiences to help guide them along the way uh, is important to me. At Gettysburg, I teach electronics, digital electronics, robotics, engineering design, uh, and a section of computer-aided drafting design. These dynamic vocational courses, uh, I think, can really benefit uh, students uh, as they pursue uh, their areas of interest. And uh, I look forward to help guiding them in that process. Each course is presented through a flip delivery system using Canvas. And uh, every course has a uh, similar layout in my uh, Canvas presentation. Um, the students will be brought to a home page such as this. Directly on that home page is my contact information, how they can get a hold of me. I hold office hours uh, during my fifth mod planning um, by appointment. So students may send me an email to this email address. We can make arrangements and I can have either a virtual Zoom meeting um, or if necessary, we can uh, stop down together and, and uh, work together here on site. Each day on Canvas, students are expected to check in with my daily attendance mark here. Um, they should check to see if there are weekly announcements that have been uh, issued to them. Uh, each course is gonna have some form of a weekly discussion where they uh, post a question and answer somebody else's question. And every course is structured through a uh, group of modules. It is the modules that become the uh, base for all the activities that are presented in the course uh, itself. Here, this is the electronics course. Um, and you'll see the uh, expectations, the lessons that are there, the videos are there, um, the assignments. It is on the assignments uh, that, that students submit work. Typically, they submit that in a PDF or a PNG format. Um, in other cases, I might ask for multimedia files of some sort uh, that they're submitting or a uh, full-blown lab report that they submit uh, with a possible reflection itself. Um, every course is laid out in a, in a similar manner. Every course is scored in a similar manner. There are penalties for late work uh, for students that do not get late uh, work in on time um, unless those students come to me in advance and explain their difficulties and uh, we work together to, to try to find a solution to whatever uh, their hangup may be. Look forward to working with your son or daughter uh, in their courses of study and um, 
hope we have a good year. Thanks.